So here I'm in Luxembourg. You can see the uh, lions here. There never have been any lions in Europe. It's a symbol of the pharaoh. It's one of the symbols of the pharaonic dignity, as it was the Sphinx before. How did they know the existence of a lion? So this place is a duchy. It's a monarchy, and it has the laws of silence around it. And it's just like in Switzerland, you know. So here it says. This is very interesting. It says uh, here Luxembourg, and it says. Saint Grand Duke Henri. They even have a prince here, and it says Saint, like in a sarcophagus, or Caesar, the King of Rome. Saint, it means the king, and a sarcophagus is a box to put the king in when he's dead, like the Tsars. Saint, it means Son Altesse Royale, His Royal Highness, like Nebuchadnezzar, the King of Babylon, like Salazar, horrible dictator in Portugal in the 70s, like the Tsars. The Windsor family, Windsor. The word sir, sire, it's all from here, they're all pharaohs. And here is some information about Templars in Luxembourg. So there have been some, of course there has been some activity in these places here. They are in uh, Eschet, Gilsdorf, Luxembourg and Vianden. They are Templars. Commanderies. Here's a list of the commanderies in Luxembourg. Well, I'm not going to film it now. It's, I mean, it's, it's all the same. Maybe I'll do it one day. But this is very important. Sa, the pharaohs. We're ruled by the pharaohs, and they did the new world order now, out of the old world order. Still the same ones. So we're being ruled by the pharaohs. That's why they take decisions in the parliament or not very favorable for the European peoples. Because they, think, don't, don't, they don't give a damn about us. They come from Egypt. So and there are the pharaonic colors of Luxembourg. Red and white for the United Kingdom of Pharaoh and blue for the war color. It's all very uh, aristocratic as you can see here. Now Pharaohs, me. And the eyes of a bloody horse. <laughs>